What up YouTube, Will here. Hope you're all doing well. Today, we're going to make my favorite appetizer of all time, period. The hot butter cuttlefish. It is probably the most popular seafood side dish in Sri Lanka. So without further ado, let's get cracking. Here I used a kilo of cuttlefish, two egg whites, 300 grams of corn flour with half a teaspoon of turmeric, 100 grams of butter, two tablespoons of chili paste, a few cloves of garlic, two or three sprigs of spring onions, a couple of red onions, capsicums, but here I used two pardon chilies, some dried red chilies, two limes, and a couple of handfuls of cashew nuts. To prepare the cuttlefish, I turned it inside out. And made slices inside to tenderize it. Then turn it back around again. and slice like so. Then I dried out all the cuttlefish with paper towels. Make sure you don't avoid this step or otherwise when you're frying the cuttlefish it'll splurt everywhere and onto yourself. Then to the egg whites I added 2 teaspoons of salt and then I added the cuttlefish and thoroughly coated them with the egg whites. Once done I whisked the turmeric powder and the corn flour together and then I coated the cuttlefish pieces one by one. Make sure you do this or otherwise all the pieces will clump together. Slice the red onions into whole rounds, then crush the garlic and finely chop. With the spring onions I initially sliced the ends into half centimeter slices and then I made slices about an inch long. The smaller pieces I will use to garnish and the bigger bits I will use in the cooking process. Then slice your capsicums or your green chilies diagonally and split the dried red chilies down the middle. With the lime, slice the ends off and then cut into wedges to use later. Then in a hot pan, toast your cashew nuts. Toss those nuts really well until they're golden like so. Then heat up some oil. I used sunflower oil to check that the oil is hot enough, I use a small piece of the cuttlefish and once you see it's floating, it's ready. Fry your cuttlefish pieces in small batches until golden. Once all of them are fried, in a pan, add your butter and melt. Once all molten, add your dried red chilies along with your chopped garlic. Once the garlic starts getting some color, add the chili paste, a teaspoon of sugar and stir really well. Once the butter has taken a deep red color, add the cuttlefish pieces and toss them. Then add 2 tablespoons of ketchup, toss once again. Once the cuttlefish pieces are all coated in the butter, add your red onions, your chilies and your spring onions. And then add your cashew nuts. Once thoroughly mixed, 
serve while still warm. And then garnish with your leftover spring onions. This hot butter cuttlefish calls to be shared with friends and family. Alongside a nice cold pint of beer, you can never go wrong. Hope you enjoyed this recipe. If you did, please like and subscribe to my channel. And of course, share with your friends. Hope you all have a lovely day. Peace.